Heinsohn was a Boston icon, but his genuine passion for the game made him a fan favorite everywhere. As Nick Emmons shows us from his knowledge of basketball to his joyous outbursts, his following went well beyond Boston. This truly is the loss of a local icon. In fact, it would be difficult to find anyone who had a deeper and closer relationship to any one organization than Tommy Heinsohn. A legend on the court, on the bench, and behind the mic. Rondo can't shoot. Rondo can't score. Sorry. Tommy Heinsohn was an icon loved by generations of Celtics faithful. I was a boy when he, he was on the Celtics. I used to listen to those games with my dad. I remember him real well. They called him Tommy Gun because of the, sh the rap rapid fire shots. It was great. News of his passing, a tough blow for fans across the city in a year that's been hard enough. Yeah, it's a big loss for, uh, for Celtics Nation. As the list of everything else. His presence with the Celtics spanned six decades. He's the only person to play a role in each of the team's 17 world championships. Former teammate and fellow Hall of Famer Bill Russell tweeted about his good friend, saying in part, in life there are a limited number of true friends. Today I lost one. For 39 years, he sat next to broadcast partner Mike Gorman, sharing many laughs and celebrations. Gorman tweeted, Celtics Nation has lost its finest voice. Rest in peace, my friend. It has been the privilege of my professional life to be the Mike in Mike and Tommy. Current Celtics coach Brad Stevens tweeted, Rest in peace, Tommy. You have meant so much to the six decades of Celtics fans that you shared the game with as a Hall of Famer in every facet, an incredible person, teammate, and mentor. While basketball was his life for so many years, his true passion was painting. Friend and fellow artist Connie Harris Nagel said he was a supreme artist and a premier basketball player. I will miss him greatly. And the Celtics summing up his impact by saying, as long as there are the Boston Celtics, Tommy's spirit will remain alive. In Boston, I'm Nick Emmons, WBC News. And we can all celebrate that. Thank you, Nick. Tonight, the Los Angeles Lakers released this tweet about Heinsohn's passing to decades of rivalry and a lifetime of respect.